YouTube, I haven't been on here in a couple days. Don't I look like a sight? Man, I look like a mess. I have done a lot of stuff at my house. What have I done? Let me tell you. I can't even think. I I'm losing it. I've washed clothes. I need to put clothes away. I made... Yesterday I made fried crab ragon for me and my mother-in-law and homemade egg drop soup. And it was really good. And I got more of that in the refrigerator. I forgot about that. I just threw it back in there. Oh, the wraps. I got the wraps. And the crab meat and the cream cheese. But I got too much going on. Everybody... It, Making all this food and then I'm working a full day's work tomorrow is pretty crazy because what I'm going to do now is I'm going to Walmart. I'm getting the rest of the stuff that I need. I got Cool Whip yesterday. I need another Cool Whip yet. And I need Maybe another cream of mushroom. Maybe, yeah, no, I don't need no more cream of mushroom. I got enough cream of mushroom. I need another Cool Whip. And I need sour cream, more sour cream. Because I'm going to make uh, ambrosia salad. Now, how do you guys make yours? I used to work in a nursing home for about six years. Six, seven years, something like that quite a bit a long time and my ma always made it my ma always made it with coconut i hated that it's like choke me city and marciano cherries and fruit like mix i i think my mom made it with mixed cocktail cocktail fruit in the can and she ain't around i need to ask my aunt but i know it so i bought I bought the only two giant, and they're giant Marciano cherries. I bought a Kroger. They were $4 a piece. They were this big, each container. But they're giant Marciano cherries. And I got a couple cans of fruit cocktail. I need mandar I need another can. That's what I need. Another can of mandarin oranges. Because that's what makes them. I love mandarin oranges on them. And, uh, and mixed fruit cocktail. And you drain all your fruit real good. And you mix it with sour cream and Cool Whip. That's where you get that fabulous taste. And it just goes with the fruit. Boy, is that compliment food. And boy, is that compliment fruit. The sour and the sweet. The sour cream. Sour of the sour cream and the sweet of the Cool Whip. So, yeah. So, I need one more can of mandarin oranges. I need a Cool Whip. And I need rolls. And I need, oh, marshmallows. Oh, my God, please, for the love of God, let Walmart have marshmallows left. I got everything else. I got everything for the green bean. Oh, and I need light brown sugar. I have some, but not enough. And uh, I need to make today. Green bean casserole, fruit salad, the ambrosia salad, um, sweet potato casserole. You know, it's just it's just brown sugar and marshmallows and sweet potatoes together. That and a little um, olive and pickle tray. I gotta get sweet pickles, sweet butter chip pickles. I got and then I need green olives. I got black olives at home. I need green olives. And, yeah, I'm going to put that all together today. The only thing I want to do tomorrow is, and I need baked potatoes, is to put, uh, is cook the potatoes to make the mashed potatoes tomorrow and cook the turkey and the stuffing. And everything else can be heated up. And then I'm going to fix everybody's plates and then go to work. And then maybe them fuckers that I live with can do the dishes. I'm in Burger King line because I'm hoping they have those French toast sticks. I'm going to get a small order of them. I'm just hungry. And that just sounded like, you know how you something just sounds good to you that I haven't had in forever? And I never see them at the damn grocery store. And I'm hoping Walmart has them today. I'm going to buy some of them, a box of them for me and whoever. 
and I need some more syrup too. Yeah, so that's the plan. And uh, ah, this line's could it move any slower? There's two or three people behind me now. I'm sure these people aren't ordering huge orders. There's nobody to work. This is the thing, you guys. I went to Burger King the other day for my family. What I'm trying to think. The day before yesterday, actually, even. Because I went to Wendy's yesterday. I, I don't know treat my family unless it's on payday. My, uh... My mother-in-law, whatever, paid for that. Well, but she can pay for something once in a while. I pay for all the food all the time. So, anyways, make a long story short. I got, my mother-in-law got a fish sandwich. She didn't even like it. She only ate half of it. So I threw the other half to the cats. I got a Whopper Junior Burger with a medium order of onion rings. I love their onion rings, Burger King. And my husband gets a double whopper, fries, and some of our onion rings he eats. It's a lot of food. He ate it all. And then, uh, but, but the problem was, what I'm talking about is these people in these places at work. The lady that served us at Burger King, I'm not bullshitting you guys. She was like this. I'm like, I told her four times to give me ten ketchup, right? She had ketchup in her hand like this. This is her hand. Ketchup's all coming out of every digit, meaning that it's it's full of ketchup. She's going like this to put it in the bag, and the bag ain't open, but she's still staring at me like this. I'm like, are you on crack? What is your problem? And I'm like, you got to open the bag to put the ketchup in there. What's wrong with everybody? Huh, dang, she's and they got they wrote the numbers on the bags for her. I was bad. I had two bags, 64. She can't, she, she's fucking giving the wrong orders out. Because as soon as I pulled up, she's asking me what my order was. She goes, Is it two cheeseburgers in a pot? I go, No, it's a double whopper. And he, I look up the meal, it's the rest of it that goes with it. She fucked up everything like why why you know what if you got somebody that's that bad get rid of them it's be better if you do the whole freaking job yourself because she's that bad she's that bad she's screwing up everything she can't even open a bag to put ketchup in it she's looking at me and going like this i'm like that's why i said are you on drugs like what's wrong with you yeah so i don't i don't stop I feel bad for people who got to work at these places, the people who are trying to work with a bunch of nut jobs, or people that don't want to be there, that don't even give a little bit of themselves. You know what? No one's busting your arm to be there. You can't be a little human, then the hell with you. I got to dye my hair today, too. I look like a freak. It's all grayed out. So, yeah, I need to dye my hair. And uh, hopefully that lasts a little bit longer. I'm trying to grow my hair out. I'm hoping I'm past the stage where it's coming straight out of my scalp and going like that because I have such thick and coarse hair and my hair has uh, colics all through it because I have natural curly hair. Um, yeah, so... I don't know why this person isn't ordering. Did they tell me? Does this guy know what he's ordering or what? Oh, God. Kill me now. Talk to me later. He's talking and you don't even know where he is. I guess he isn't ordering. I guess they told him not to. I'm trying to see if they have the French toast sticks there. Because that's all I want. Like a small order of four or six of them. Extra syrup, and I'm good. And give me a pop, and let me get the hell out of here. So anyways, yeah. So, luckily our order was right, but she was screwing up everything. It's just these people don't, like... And I got wrong orders from everybody lately. From two weeks ago, they must have my order twice at, at Taco Bell and at Burger King twice. And then the man, that's why the manager knew who I was yesterday. He's like, fresh fish damage, but like you're like you're impressing me. 
that uh, freak security drives around here and uh they don't want nobody to go and get baths and body works over here they got security yeah you know what they got behind me before and get behind me they wouldn't let me out i'll, I'll run you right over but I don't want to do that with my boss's car because he's an ex-cop. <laughs> He'd kick my ass. So, yeah. Come on. Learn to say. Just order your damn food and get up there. People getting on my nerves. Anyways, I'm going to let you beautiful people go. This is a quick check-in to tell you guys hello. Don't stress yourself out for Thanksgiving. You know what? I'm not letting this shit stress me out today. Because, you know what? Life is what we make it. And I don't want to get stressed out over Thanksgiving. And I got to work on top of it all. Four days in a row. Yeah, that's okay. You know what I'm saying? It's just too much to be stressed out about all the time. Screw that. I'm going to take it nice and easy. Make what I make. Do my hair. I'm going to... Do it all slow, and it's going to work out good. God bless you all. You all have a happy Thanksgiving. I'll do another one tomorrow, a YouTube vlog to show you I'm at a lot on Thanksgiving, eating my Thanksgiving meal. But that's what we have to do to survive in America. we got to work on holidays and everything. I work on Thanksgiving, Christmas Eve, Christmas Day, New Year's Eve, New Year's Day. Don't say I don't earn my dime. God bless you all. Have a good day and subscribe to my channel. There's lots more different things to come here on this channel. Believe me, it's going to be exciting and I love you all. Have a great day. Bye.